Hello students, today we are going to solve numerical of centrifugal pump. The question is written as the internal and external diameter of the impeller of a centrifugal pump are 200 mm and 400 mm respectively. The pump is running at 1200 rpm. The vane angles of the impeller at inlet and outlet are 20 degree and 30 degree respectively. The water enters the impeller radially and velocity of flow is constant. Now we have to determine the work done by the impeller per unit weight of water. Now we will write the given quantities first. Internal diameter of impeller that is D1 will be equals to 200 mm which is given in the question. So we will convert this value in terms of meter it will be equals to 0.2 meter. Similarly external diameter of impeller will be equals to D2 which is given in the question as 400 mm. So it will be equals to 0.4 meter. Now speed is also given in the question that is 1200 rpm. So we will write here n equals to 1200 rpm. Similarly vane angle at inlet is given as 20 degree. So we will write theta equals to 20 degree which is shown here. Now vane angle at outlet that is 5 will be equals to 30 degree which is given in the question here and which is shown in this diagram here that is 5. Now water enters radially means alpha is equals to 90 degree and Vw1 will be equals to 0. So velocity of flow Vf1 will be equals to Vf2. Now tangential velocity of impeller at inlet and outlet are u1 equals to pi into d1 into n upon 60. We had studied this formula earlier. So we will just put the values here that is pi into 0 0.20 into 1200 divided by 60. So u1 will be equals to 12.56 meter per second. Similarly u2 will be equals to pi into d2 into n upon 60. It will be equals to pi into 0 0.40 into 1200 upon 60. After solving this we will have the value equals to 25.13 meter per second that is the value of u2. Now from inlet velocity triangle that is shown here tan theta will be equals to vf1 upon u1 that is perpendicular upon base. So we will write it as tan theta will be equals to vf1 upon u1. Now we have to calculate the value of vf1 and u1 value we already known that is 12.56 and theta value is already known to us that is 20 degree. After solving this we will have the value of vf1 which will be equals to 4.57 meter per second. So vf2 will be also same because vf1 will be equals to vf2 so it will be equals to 4.57 meter per second. Now from outlet velocity triangle which is shown here tan phi will be equals to vf2 upon u2 minus vw2 which is shown here that is tan phi will be equals to perpendicular that is vf2 and base will be only this much that is u2 minus vw2. So we will put the values here that is 25.13 minus vw2 will be equals to 4.57 upon tan phi that is 10 30 degree. After solving this we will have the value of Vw2 which will be equals to 17.215 meter per second. So we had calculated the value of Vw2 also. Now work done by impeller per kg of water per second is given by one by g into vw2 into u2 we will put the values here that is 17.215 into 25.13 divided by 9.81 after solving this we will have the value equals to 44.1 newton meter per newton that is the value of work done by the impeller per unit weight of 
वॉटर दैट इज ऑल अबाउट दिस न्यूमेरिकल थैंक यू वेरी मच स्टूडेंट्स